So I had a pretty good fun day of invasions today. Um, I kept running into this group here with um, Nerd Guy or whatever his name is. Um, him and his buddy must have been using the Taunter's Tongue and just looking for fights. And uh, both rock in the Madness Spears and, you know, they're trying to look alike. Maybe to try to confuse on who they should try to kill and whatever. Uh, so you see here, my dude busts out the Madness. He's jumping. And uh, I pray late charge into it for that hyper armor. Eventually he caught me. I start healing up and realize it was the host that I killed, not the other guy. And uh, the wolves come in to help me out. And, you know, pray late's charge. That hyper armor just, uh, <laughs> it won the day. Even though, you know, the madness eventually broke me out of it. But I had done the damage before it was too late. Uh, here we got an invasion after the fact. And we ended up in the Lake of Rot. And I'm using the Conceal and Veil. I was going to try to blast those guys off the platform, but uh, we got ourselves, you know, the cop showed up. We get a blue, even though he's using the ring so he doesn't look blue. And uh, looks like a big Great Spear user. He's, uh, he's roll catching. He's fighting pretty well. He's, you know, mixing it up a little bit. So I see he knows what he's doing, so I switch over to one-handed, uh, make him think that I'm going to try to parry spam, uh, throw out a single parry. He's not buying the bite, but I think I gave him just enough more to think about that uh, it threw him off his game once the shield came out. So I get his health down real low. I uh, thought I was going to finish it there, but uh, good hitboxes went right over his head. Uh, we're in for a little bit of a fight here. He's seeing what he can do. I bait out the attack and use the hyperama to finish him off. GG to this guy. A uh, fun little interlude here. And um, now it's time to see what the host and his buddy are up to. Uh, I know I still got the concealing veil back on, so I duck down uh, and throw the cannon back on to get back to what I was doing before the blue show showed up. And uh, the blue showed up right behind me, so I was glad I took a peek instead of just... Uh, trying to mess with these guys but uh i'm not walking across the lake to uh get myself rotted to fight the two of you on a little platform so uh, i figure the best thing to do is knock them in and uh see if either i can bait them to come over to me or you know just let the rot do its business because the rot here is brutal um so it took a couple shots at them they don't seem too eager to move so i figure i'll just bust the cannon back out and uh yeah, that's when I started blasting. So they think they can hide behind this thing. The uh, explosion's got a good radius on it. I try to get him. Um, he's not having it, but I think he realizes at this point I'm just going to keep shooting him. So uh, he came over, figured he'd try his, uh, try his luck at fighting me. Tried to heal the rot there. Maybe I should have gave him a chance, but uh, I'm in an invasion here. I'm not in a duel. So took him out, went to fight the other guy, and... Uh, I guess he was the host, so that's the end of that one. And now we get right back into it, and, uh, you know, we got uh, the self-proclaimed nerd again. And him and his buddy, they're, I know they're dangerous. They both uh, rock in madness. Um, not really sure yet at this point how high level his friend is, because last time I ended up just killing him. Uh, they immediately throw the um, don't try to heal stuff at me. But uh, I'm healing up anyways because the Prelates charge on the Great Stars. I get some great passive HP when you get regen. Uh, took the host out, got backstabbed in the process, but um, too little too late, my friend. The invasion's already over, and you let your host down. Um, so next up here is, you know, doing more of the Prelates charge just because I can't get enough of a... Uh, how fun and stupid this is so we got a couple wild boys here he's using wild strikes he's using wild strikes and uh i want to see how good the hyper armor is against that so you can see i took what two three hits of the wild strikes did nothing to me i couldn't care less about it just kept charging right through it um unfortunately for him he uh couldn't stand up to it nearly as well as i did so um that was the end of that Got a couple more guys here down in, um, you know, one of the catacombs. Not the catacombs, one of the caves. It's one of these, uh, you know, find some uh, upgrade material caves. This dude's got a great shield, and he's blocking me. Um, not breaking it, but he's bleeding out. He finally realizes that he's losing a lot of HP, tries to jump out of the way, and uh, 
you know? <laughs> the blood did its trick. The other guy here, he goes down. I thought I was going to have to find a host somewhere else. He's hiding as a phantom for some reason. And that's the end of those two. And then uh, last but not least here, ran into the nerd boy and his buddy again. So uh, here's the trilogy out in the wide open here. Every time I fought these guys, well, the first time there were some wolves around. But um, usually they find themselves, I don't know if they were ganking or they're just playing through with the taunter's tongue. Um, this time they switch it up a little bit, I thought, and he was going to do something other than madness, but um, I just pushed myself out of the madness fire. Uh, wasn't quite enough to take him out, so I do have the phantom this time, and I made it a point. I wanted to kill the phantom, so trying to see how high level he is, if he's an honest phantom, or if he just dropped gear from the other guy, I'm not sure what's going on. Uh, the host is throwing the spectral spear at me, or the spectral lance, whatever that Ash of War is. Uh, it's not a very good one, but uh, it's doing enough to distract me a little bit. They would have been better off trying to make sure I couldn't heal again, but um, they didn't try that this time, at least not right away. They're throwing poison, they're doing everything they can at me. Right there he gets me with the don't heal, but... Um, I got my FP back, and he did not have what it took to get out of the way of the Prelates charge. The host is now just an easy pickings, and that's the end of the Madness Brother trilogy. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed what I had for you today, and uh, until next time, take care.